We're catching up now with National FFA Secretary Jessica Herr, who's joining us originally from the Pennsylvania chapter. First of all, you just got done giving a keynote address. What were you chatting with about these FFA members? Absolutely. So a large part of my FFA experience has always been surrounded by community. And the reason why I stayed in FFA is because of the community that I experienced within it. So my keynote is just about that, the community that we experience not only in FFA, but also in agriculture. And I end the keynote with kind of a challenge to students. I hope to live my life in a way that builds a longer table, not a higher fence. Tables are warm and inviting and create a space for people to feel seen and heard. And I felt that way in FFA, and I hope to encourage FFA members all across the country to do the same. So in addition to that keynote address, you have a lot of interaction with these Nebraska yes. FFA members. What else do you do while you're here in Lincoln? Absolutely. So I have the opportunity to present some leadership workshops that I've written, um, talking about goal setting and agriculture and FFA. And I also have the opportunity to celebrate and cheer on and encourage students who are competing in different contests here this week in Lincoln, and also just enjoying convention and getting to know a little bit more about Nebraska. Okay, I mentioned you are from Pennsylvania. Have you been to Nebraska before? I've never been. This is my first time. Okay, so tell us about Pennsylvania agriculture then. Yes, absolutely. So in Pennsylvania, I'm in from the southeastern corner of the state. Diversified agriculture is very popular. So I grew up on, um, I'm the fifth generation to my family's dairy, poultry, and crop farm. So especially in the part of the state that I'm from, dairy uh, production as well as uh, egg or layer production is very popular. Um, I grew up on a bro broiler farm, excuse me, which means we grow our chickens for Tyson um, for meat. So very common in that corner of the state as well as that corner of the United States. Very cool. Always love learning about different yes. states. Very cool. Okay, so the rest of the year, you know, we always think about national convention, but you guys do a whole lot more than that. What do you do throughout the year? Absolutely. So I serve on a team of six officers and we spend about 300 days on the road traveling to conventions like this, interacting with students, as well as visiting some of our corporate partners, corporate sponsors, visiting their headquarter offices, learning more about their companies and thanking them for their continued support of FFA and its programs. We also serve as student leaders on our board of directors at National FFA, um, acting as the student voice to ensure their students can have the best experience inside these blue jackets. Okay, what's one thing you've learned about Nebraska FFA that you'll take back to the national organization? So when I came to Nebraska, I was told that there's something called Nebraska nice. And I felt nothing but included and have a warm welcome of people here who are so nice and so encouraging. And so it's been so wonderful to get to meet each and every student here and experiencing some of that Nebraska nice. Well, it's been good to meet you. Thank you so much, Jessica. Thank you. That again was Jessica Herr, National FFA Secretary, joining us.